Hi, Aaron Sylvan here with a very quick fix. I'm going to show you how to make your Kodak SP360 compatible with GoPro products using only a bolt. You need a 1032 bolt that's one and a quarter inches long and what's called a number 10 SAE washer. You can buy these for almost nothing. These two together will make it so you can use GoPro accessories with your Kodak SP360. Why would you want to do that? Well, here's the problem. If you want to mount your SP360 on a tripod, your only choice is to use the selfie stick that Kodak provides. Here it is. The problem is that it's very wobbly and there's nothing you can do about it. So here's how we're going to make a fix. First, buy a product that you enjoy. I like this Off-Road by Manfrotto, which cost about $50, but there's other choices ranging from 20 to 100. And step one is to remove this uh, this nut that's on the end. You can use the machine screw you just bought. Just put that in, push it through, right? And this nut comes out. Okay, you see a hole where it used to be. Now, unscrew the bottom part of your Kodak rig. Attach the Kodak rig to the Manfrotto tripod. Here we go. So there is a locking nut that's, uh, that's here on the Kodak rig, which is staying where it is. We removed the locking nut from Manfrotto. The reason why is because you, if you have a locking nut on both sides at the same time, then a screw won't uh, hold it tight. Trust me on this one. Okay, you're going to need to have your own screwdriver as well. And here's where the washer comes in. Put the washer onto your screw. Okay. And that's to keep it. For, to, that's to keep the head of the screw from getting stuck inside the area where that uh, where that locking nut used to be previously. I'm trying to give you a good view. Here we've got the screw and the washer going into the Manfrotto piece, and the screw on the other side is going to meet with the locking nut that's left over from the Kodak. I can get this through with my fingers most of the way and then I'll need a screwdriver to tighten it. Now I know what you're thinking, that's a little bit annoying carrying around a screwdriver and what are you going to do if you're out on a shoot and you lose the screwdriver or you have, you, you know, you, it's not as easy to work with as what Kodak provided that you can use with your fingers. That's possible, but here's the issue. This piece from Kodak is the only reason that you can't use GoPro products. And the reason why is because it's not long enough. So all you need to do is buy your own 1032 machine screws and you can buy these in just about any size that you want, any length. I find that one and a quarter inches is exactly right. And now, no more wobble. No more wobble. Thanks for watching and if you found this useful, look me up.